Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing this Halloween charm kit and it's really compact and cute. I believe it comes with a little acrylic piece, some glitters, some stickers, and a ball chain, and I guess we can take a close look at it. Here's a sheet with the instructions. It's written in Japanese, but it looks very, very simple. So I'm going to get started and see if we can make a really cute looking Halloween charm. I'm going to start by taking a little moon and putting this sticker on it. After a couple attempts, I got this sticker on. It said if there's any excess, you can cut it off using a blade, but I think I got it on okay. So I'm just going to go on to the next step. I lied, guys. I skipped the step of putting the little eye pin bail thingy in. So I'm going to do that, letting it stick out just a little bit. And that makes it a little bumpy, but I think that's going to be okay once the resin goes on. Or I'm hoping so, anyway. I'm going to use the rest of the stickers and decorate this little moon. I'm just going to follow the guide and do it the same way. Now that the stickers are on, I'm going to take a little piece of masking tape or washi tape and just cover up the little hole here so it doesn't get filled with resin. I'm going to take a clear folder in case the resin overflows and place the moon on top. And now it is time for resin! I'm going to be using UV resin and of course you can use two-part resin. It'll just take a lot longer to cure. Very carefully, I'm going to spread a thin layer of resin over the piece. Finally, I'm going to take a dab of this glitter on my toothpick and spread it onto the charm. I think the glitter helps spice it up a lot. Now I'm going to pop this into my UV lamp and let it cure for about two minutes until it is hard. And it is complete! Well, actually, there is a jump ring and a ball chain to put on, but I don't have my pliers with me right now, so that will be later. But that glitter really added a lot of spice to this charm, and I think it brought it all together. I like this a lot, a lot. At first I was like, mmm, stickers on plastic, okay, but... I am very, very excited with the result. It looks super, super cute. For those of you who are wondering, I purchased this kit at Pandora House, which is a craft store here in Japan. And I believe it was somewhere under 700 yen, somewhere around there. I don't know, give or take a little bit, but it was about that much, so about 7 US dollars maybe. And I think that was totally worth it. I mean, you have to provide your own resin, but other than that, you get a really, really cute keychain. I would definitely say this is store quality. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me make this kit. It was a lot of fun to make. I'm excited to try the other one. And I think I saw some Christmas ones at the store too, so maybe I'll check them out. Let me know if you liked it and if you think I should do some more. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye!